Sevens coach Tim Walsh. How are you finding the talent here? Yeah, mate, it's really good. Um, we've got the, the Olympians out there playing as well, um, all the contracted girls, and then uh, trying to find the, the next bunch coming through and giving experience to, uh, to everybody, so it's great. I'm here with Cassie, Australian Women's Sevens star. Do you have a favourite move, pre-game ritual? What, do you like to, what song do you listen to? Uh, probably, uh, actually... And why Justin Bieber? <laughs> No, I do like Justin Bieber though. I do like Justin Bieber, but I like 50 Cent before I start. Oh shit, bit of candy shot. Adelaide's our captain here, Lauren. There's a lot of dancing going on before. They've all sort of disappeared out the back. Who's the best dancer in the team? Oh, I'd have to be Eva Capane. Like, she's got some serious moves. <laughs> is that a regular thing around there, is it? Um... Uh, yeah, it's pretty regular. Like We try and get pumped up before we head out to warm up and playing some good beats. It's generally the way to do it. All right. You don't have to talk to me. You can you can talk to Ben or me. If you don't want to do an interview, just tell me. No, as in like, am I looking at you? Do we yeah, I think that's, no, I'm kidding, it's fine. All right, eye oh, contact. You've already done it. How really are you? Yeah, I'm, I'm here with, sorry, I broke it first, she wins. Chloe Dalton, Australian woman, seven superstar. I actually follow her on Instagram. Oh, i got to give you a follow back. Yes! Sash Med, here it is. Speaking of dancing, I saw that you guys have been dancing on the field a bit. You've come away with a win. Um, how's that going for you? Yeah, really, really good. So, in um, comparison to last one, it's just we're going so much better and we've improved so much as a team, so it's been really good. The one and only Australian champion, <laughs> Olympian, gold medal, Charlotte Catholic, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. I'm seeing a lot of banter happening back here. The girls are having a good time. How do you, how do you rate this new tournament? Um, yeah, it's been really fun. I think um, our Sevens Rugby style has always been really fun, like the way the Australian team plays as well. Women's, women's Sevens Rugby, are you, are you getting to uh, watch a bit or are you a bit busy? Yeah, no, I have been watching a bit. It's quite good. I, our women's rugby teams, our Aussie women's rugby Sevens teams are probably better than the Wallabies, in my opinion. Uh, where do you see women's Sevens in, a, say, like five years from now? I think it's going to just keep growing. And maybe get paid, eh? Yeah, that'd be the dream. <laughs> That'll be perfect. No, it's been really cool. It's such a good vibe and um, it's fun playing against your friends and also sometimes a little bit weird. Who do you like playing against the most? There's got to be someone from the Aussie team who you're like, I can't wait to smash her. Uh, probably Emma Sykes. <laughs> she just told me to run it straight at her, so. Oh, uh, did she? <laughs> and, and you're gonna? Probably not. Obviously the Aussie girls are split um, amongst all the different unis, so good to have a bit of chat with them, try and psych them out pre-game. Hey! How you going? I'm Jared. I'm better. Better? <laughs> Yeah, shout out to the sister. Sure. How, how are you finding your day here? Oh, it's really good experience. Like, it's lovely, like, playing against <laughs> these Aussie girls. Like, Love um, smashing them? No. Kind of. <laughs> the girls seem like they're having a bit of a good time. Uh, is it a bit more of a festival vibe? Is it, is it similar to your sevens when you go around international? Is it? Yeah, very, very similar. I think um, there's, there's a certain way that the Aussie girls prepare for games, and uh, it's very much having fun and uh, and living in the moment and then taking that enjoyment out onto the field. Yeah, women's rugby, do you think they should be getting paid? Yeah, of course. How much? As much as the blokes. And how much are you getting paid? Not enough. Yeah. <laughs> are you surprised by the quality on show at, at, in this tournament? It's a new seven, uh, Uni Sevens tournament. Are you, have you been a bit taken aback about how competitive the field is? Yeah, it's been awesome. Like even over the past couple of months, seeing how hard all the teams have been working, like it's been quite a professional setup, I think. And so seeing the quality out there is awesome, and really good to have another pathway for, for Aussie Rugby Sevens for the women. Do you have a move you like to do when you score a try? No, no moves. Strictly no moves. No, just put the ball down. Oh, can I suggest because the Brumbies, Canberra, maybe just a. <laughs> okay, 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 I'll think about it. I'll think about it. I don't like being too superstitious because like you know how people have their favourite undies and stuff? Like what if you lose them? Personally, don't wear them. <laughs> um, I don't know, I don't have too many. My socks have always got to be like perfectly level, even though it lasts probably like 10 seconds. It's not bad. Let's see, game. hold on. One and a half, one and three, ooh, maybe that's why you lost. Maybe you need a superstition. Yeah, I think I need to get one after that performance. So, University of Queensland, Bond University, intense rivalry. I'm surprised by the comradeship. Is it quite a feature of the women's game? Yeah, you know. Yeah, she's a little Tribe Sevens yeah. player. Just oh. a little one? A little one. Yeah, a little one. A little Still baby. little. Who do you not look forward to playing against out of the uh, Z7s girls? Emily Cherry for um, University of Queensland. We call her the GOAT because she is she is a women's sevens version of Jonathan Thurston, I, I would argue. Alicia Quirk would like to think that she's the toughest, but I don't know about it. You got caught out, Alicia. Vita, what's your plans for later in the day? 
Alan and Nate just like, you know, just preparing for the finals <laughs> and just getting ready to go back to um, some study. He's got some exams coming up. <laughs> some study? Oh, yeah, procrast <laughs> this is a really elaborate way of procrastinating. Oh, I'm going to join the Women's Seven so I don't have to study. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Great day of footy down here at Macquarie Uni. The University of Queensland has just defeated Bond in the final of the Women's Sevens. It was a quality game. They stole it at the death. Last minute try to seal it. Finally time to acknowledge some uh, women's rugby down here.